got what you deserve when dealing with me. I'm a lit person. I'm a fun person. I'm very friendly. So if I act up around you, if I act up towards you, it's for a motherfucking reason, bitch. What up, YouTube? It's Kiki Ko, and I'm back at it with another video. If you're new to my channel, hey, boo. For today's video, I'm going to be doing this summery look. Yes, yes, yes. I told you guys I'm coming in with color. I know it's been a while since I've done a tutorial. I know, I know, I know. But I am back. If you guys want to see me playing with this look, keep on watching. I'm going to be applying tape on the sides of my eyes to give my eyeshadow and my eyeliner some definition. I really hope that's even. Now just taking my double-sided blending brush from top. And I'm gonna go in with this turquoise shade. I'm putting the shade all over my crease and dragging it out. Because I'm doing a drag cut crease. I really don't know the real name of it. That's just what I call it. I never really heard of anybody like calling a specific name. People just be saying cut crease, but I just want to be a little more specific. So y'all know what I'm talking about. Just calmly dragging it out onto the tape. Building it up a little more. Now I'm taking my other girl pro concealer and I'm gonna use this to cut my crease. That's something like I took a shit, no lie. Taking this concealer brush called Beauty Number no. 012. I always use this concealer brush. Now I'm going to take my setting spray just to wet my brush a little bit. Because now I'm going to go in with a shimmery color and I want it to have a lot of pigment. So now I'm going in with this green shimmer color right here. I'm applying this all over my bed. Guys, I really dubbed going to the pool today. Everybody want to go to the pool today and I said no, I have to record a video. So please, 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 if you're enjoying this video so far, go like this video right now as I'm speaking and show me some love. Let's get this video to 100 likes. There is like not enough pigment still. It's kind of weird. So I'm using the Elf Professional Eyeshadow Brush. This is just a flat brush. Maybe I put too much water from the setting spray. Now I'm going in with the NYX Liquid White Liner. And this is the first time I use a white liner, so we're gonna see how this turns out. In my head, it turned out really good. Let's see how it looks when I actually try it on. And I'm gonna just apply this right where I cut the crease. Now that we got our electric light vibe going on, I'm going in with my regular jet black liner from ELF. I already moisturized before I left my house, so my face is very moisturized. And my face does not need any more moisturizer because that shit will get oily. Oil. So I'm going in with my baby skin Insta Pore Race. I put this every place that I get oily at. That chicken on my face, I'm getting oily. Oil. Don't y'all just love Sky from Black Ink? She's my favorite. Like, people might say she's annoying, this, that she's extra. Like, I really don't care. Like, without her, what the fuck is the show? There's no point of the show without Sky. People that say like she's so extra, like girl, she's on TV. It's a drama. Like it's a reality TV show. Reality TV shows is all about drama. Who's gonna sit here and watch a reality TV show about people's lives or whatever the fuck they do if there's no drama in it? Like, let's be honest. Would you? I wouldn't. <laughs> Period. I feel like I fuck with Sky so much because I would low key act like her, especially when I'm drunk. Girl, I be like a whole TV star when I'm fucking drunk. Girl, if a bitch get me fucked up, bro, bitches be having me fucked up. So, why last week I went to some party with my friends and we left to go to some boys' house? Cause you know we want to get, we wanted to get like lit, like dance, and, you know, have more fun. So we went over there, and what had occurred was. They wanted to replay the same type of music, which is called bachata in Spanish. I don't know how to say it in English. It's like the Spanish one, two step, one, two step, shit like that. And I love bachata, feel me? Don't get me wrong. I'm Dominican. I love bachata. But bitch, all night, it's three in the morning. Why are you taking me to a crib to dance bachata? That's something that's in a family function. 
I do not want to go out at 3 a.m. to Das Bachata. I want to go out to twerk. I want to go out to get lit. Like, it was the first day of summer. And I'm here like, yo, it's the first day of summer. Y'all niggas better fucking get fucking lit. Put some twerk in show. I'm fucking up. So they got mad because I started changing the music. And one of the girls was like, oh, you got to go. Uh -uh. And my idiot ass, like, I'm a whole, like, I'm a whole problem. Like, do not get me started when I'm drunk. I'm a whole problem. So I'm really like, oh, you're gonna have to take me out. <laughs> um, the girl was like coming at me with her, talking about I'm sloppy, blah blah blah. And accusing me of shit that I wasn't that I didn't even do just because you know I was like the most drunk there. And the reason I was so drunk was because I was mixing and I've never done that. So you know, mixing and stuff, obviously I got a type of drunk that you know it made me forget shit. Like, I never got that drunk that I forgot shit. So that was the first time that happened. I know not to do that again. But at the end of the day, they was coming for me. Apparently, I asked a couple of people to fight. Everybody was talking shit about me, but nobody wanted to fight. And that just shows, like, don't talk shit if you're not going to fight. Because I'm sober now, and I feel like I still had my reasons to why, why I acted the way I did. You feel me? Like, if I didn't have my reasons, I would have been like, I regret acting like that. And honestly, I don't, like, you get what you deserve when dealing with me. I'm a lit person. I'm a fun person. I'm very friendly. So if I act up around you, if I act up towards you, it's for a motherfucking reason, bitch. As I was walking out, I was like, if anybody want to fight, I'll be in the hallway. <laughs> when my friend was telling me this, I was like, I fucking love myself for that. Hey, I really love myself and I fuck with myself heavy for that. You feel me? Like, what? Piss. Like, I really felt like I should have been on a reality TV show after that. On some shit. Like, I don't really like, um, getting into problems. I really don't like that. But that night, girl, that's how you know bitches had me fucked up. I ain't give no type of fucks. And I'm glad I acted the way I did. The reason I keep repeating that is because... Apparently one of the girls that I had gone with I had gone with like somebody that I'm cool with and his friends one of his friends Came to me talking about Oh, if I didn't know you I would fuck you up I told the bitch so you want to fight and she said no So it's like how you acting tough Not knowing how I am like Don't let this pretty face fool you guys. I'm really with this shit like it just takes the right um time and place for me to act out and that was it. So now that I'm baking, I'm using the LA Girl Pro Concealer. And now I'm using the shade Creamy Beige. It's a little lighter than Pure Beige. Because that's the one that was my go to. When I would set it and stuff like that, it would get darker than what it actually is. And it would get darker than my skin tone. When in reality, the, the concealer is supposed to be lighter than my skin tone. So this is why I want to shade up. And I'm going with Creamy Beige. And I absolutely love it. It's an amazing concealer. It works well for my skin tone. It does. If I put it on alone, if I want to do a simple look with some eyebrows and concealer, mascara and color the day. It does not look like my under eyes is darker than my face because that's what it would look like with the pure beige. So if you're around my skin tone and you have problems with the pure beige from Eddie Girl Pro Concealer, here you go. Use the creamy beige. Period, poo. Now using this powder brush from Tarte and I'm going to use it to contour my face with my Too Faced Coca Contour. I use this every single time. Period. Using this thin spoon brush to contour my nose. I always do this as well for the most part. So now going back to define my cheekbone contour. Defining my nose as well. Now I'm taking this powder brush from out to remove all the excess powder. Now I'm gonna go in with this L bronzing duo, but I'm only use this bronzer for today because I'm gonna be using a different blush. Hello to the new blush. This is the NYX Professional Makeup Ombre Blush. This is how it looks inside. Isn't this fucking beautiful? This is the mirror I've been using this whole time, by the way. Uh -huh. Taking my blush brush from Tarte, and let's try this blush out. <laughs> ah, 
and love new things. I love that this part is lighter because it's like a highlight on top of the blush. And the blush has shimmer as well. It's like, I saw the light. This is on the tip of my nose. Cute. Now going back in with the turquoise color and I'm putting it under my bottom lash line. Now going in with my Too Faced Better Than Sex Waterproof Mascara. Going in with my Shady Shampoo I don't know what the fuck is the name of this shit is, but I bought this in AliExpress. If y'all did not know about AliExpress, two dollars and some change for this, no tax. Y'all yeah, you know the best eyelashes. Y'all yeah, just will see when I come back. I am back. My lashes are on. Now it's time for the most important part of any makeup look, and that's the highlight. I'm going in with the Ulfa highlighter in Bali, and I'm using my M310 brush to do so. Taking my Morphe pencil brush to highlight any small areas. I'm going in with the Kiss Luxury Lip Liner and I'm going to use it as an eyeliner to put it on my waterline. See if I can use this MAC lipstick. See if it won't look weird. This is the Dayu A04. I don't even know if they have this in the store no more. Because this is so old. But you can get a nude color that can match it. I'm going to take it off in the middle. And then just reapply the lip gloss. Okay, this is cute. Like, I forgot what it is. <laughs> now going in with the e.l.f. A makeup mist and set. And I'm taking it all around the world. Going back in with my sponge to blend everything out. Okay guys, so that's it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please make sure to like, comment, and share, and subscribe to my channel for more beauty videos.